Hi everybody, all my followers, everybody on YouTube, welcome to another video. This video today is on a Reno uh, Master, 2011 Reno Master. Uh, I believe this is the F3300, I think. But it doesn't really matter. Uh, what I'm going to take you through here is on how to remove this. So we're going to remove the speed limiter. Uh, it is limited to 68 miles per hour or 110 kilometers per hour. And uh, we're going to attempt to remove that. And uh, the tool we're going to use for to do that is going to be clip. So we're going to put everything ready to go, turn everything on. And then uh, I will take you through the process of removing the speed limiter. Okay, so just before we move on, and uh, so uh, I make this video a little bit more uh, complete with more information. I've tried, I got the Maxi C's out, and the Maxi C's does have uh, the option to actually uh, work around the speed limiter. Um, it doesn't tell me I can remove the speed limit, but it tells me this which theoretically means I can set the speed limit to let, let's go to kilometers per hour so uh, or miles per hour so 78 miles per hour 130, uh, 130 kilometers per hour and in multiples of 6 or 10 kilometers so which means I can set up to 78 miles per hour or I can just set up 200 kilometers per hour so it doesn't tell me I can remove the speed limit but in other end, it's the same, isn't it? I can just put increase the speed limit to 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 a speed that the van will never reach that. So, so in a way, I can do that with a maxi sys. So to get to this, all we need to do it's going to cancel this. All we need to do is come obviously through. So this is pretty much your main menu. Main menu. You come to control unit, injection. And then under injection, we go to configuration, and then you have SC040, which is your speed limiter. So this is how it would be done with the Maxi Sys, but I'm still I'm going to use clip, and I'll show you in clip how that's done. Okay, so we are now. Um using clip we are in the engine ECU and just before we go nowhere I want to show you here that uh, what is that oh that uh, PR 87 um, 879 it tells me the maximum permissible speed 110 which is just what we have seen on the sticker um, and that's uh, what we want to change now so from here uh, so we are obviously inside the, the well, we are diagnosing the engine ECU. So from here we go to, uh, I believe it's repair, it's going to be repair perhaps. Yeah, it should be on under repair. Configurations. Speed limiter. So it tells me actually the same text as the Maxi Sys. Nevertheless, we press next. So it tells me he's under 10. Uh, it tells me what's the new limitation. I'm not 100% sure if I would put something like zero, if that would mean no speed limitation. But all I'm going to do, I'm going to do this. Under 20. Oh, well, actually, hang on a minute. I've been silly now. All I need to do is put inactive. That's it. And we press validate and he's doing his thing uh, the configurations have been carried out switch off the ignition uh, wait for the communication lost message to appear in the diagnostic tool if there is no wait for nine minutes so we're gonna turn the ignition off take the key out
and it seems like the message is not coming up so what we're gonna do is we're gonna wait for nine minutes oh actually hang on there it is now we're gonna turn the ignition back on ignition back on I'm gonna press OK. I'm gonna press finish. And what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna come back to here. We're gonna come back to here. And uh, my maximum permissible speed is now 200 kilometers per hour. So that was just just what I said, really. When when you actually select inactive, it just changes that to 200. Obviously, this one will never reach 200. So, so if I would set the speed limit to 200 or just select inactive, that's it. Um, Maxi says obviously I didn't want any further. It might be that step further. You can actually select inactive and obviously that will do the same thing. But I think this is quite easy. Um, and that's it. Um, the the spin limit is now being removed. I really hope uh, that you enjoyed the video. I hope there's something here that you guys are gonna um, are gonna like it. Um, if you still have any questions, any comments, uh, just put them below. And like always guys, thank you so much for watching.